Welcome back, everyone, to another Leal Legacy Classic Cartoon Commentary. Today, we're hanging out with the one and only Oswald the Lucky Rabbit and the Bandmaster from 1931. May 18th, 1931, to be precise. Directors Walter Lance and William Bill Nolan. Well, here we go. I love the... Uh, you know, the musically driven shorts. And Bandmaster is one of those themes that has, like, every character's done it probably multiple time, <laughs> times over the years. <laughs> okay, all this makes way more sense <laughs> now that we're not so vignetted on solely just Oswald. Look at this, it's a marching band. How often is it a marching band? Usually it's like a band stand, right? Uh it's a musical note? Yeah, okay. He just pulled something, yeah, slimy and black. He pulled, like, the Venom symbiote out of, uh, that trombone. Imagine if that was the cartoon. Imagine if that was the storyline here. <laughs> All these instruments are full of the Venom symbiote. And I apologize to those of you who are not... Marvel comic nerds. <laughs> they made a Venom movie. You should understand that reference. Anyway. Back to the action. <laughs> wow. It's amazing that this person's girth is all lung power. <laughs> uh, hey! Was that a utilitale? Much like Felix the Cat, Oswald just used his tail at- What's happening here? What were these awkward puppies doing in that trombone? Oh! That dog did not look like it was the parent of any of those puppies. Um... I got distracted. What happened? What, what was I saying? Man. Eesh. Aww. <laughs> That's a happy turn of events. Look at this. Oswald's just the bandmaster of reality. He can conduct anything and anyone. Oh. A very not Mickey Mouse looking squirrel. That was a really aggressive move. Oh, the utilitail. That's what I was saying. Felix the cat in his old shorts, can use his tail in just outstanding ways. And I call it the utilitail. Oswald turning his tail into an umbrella. That's a perfect example of a utilitail. And Oswald, I didn't know he had that in his, in his pocket. Alright, nah, this hippo baby is a little much. Conduct him. Conduct the baby. Make music out of this. Here we go. Oswald, you crafty, crafty rabbit. Here we go. <laughs> Shouting in melody, in a melody. Oh boy, aggressive. Is that the second time Oswald's been cracked over the head in this? Yeah, he's he's delusional now. He may have been delusional with the birds, but these dancing flowers is a clear indication of brain damage. Now I'm hard pressed to believe any of this is actually happening, or it may all just be <sighs> Oswald suffering from a concussion and experiencing hallucinations. <sighs> I love those dance. Look at that. I wish I could dance like that. I've never actually tried. I can't really dance, but you know what? I've never tried it that way. Maybe that's my calling right there. Okay, the faces are creeping me out a little bit now. It's just, they're, they're not changing. How scared would you be if you woke up in the middle of the night 
And those two things were just dancing. Oh, there we go. I'm less concerned now. Oh. Uh. Oh. Oh boy. Well, they can't really be Oswald hallucinations because the little hit baby hippo can see everything. Well, what if the baby hippo is also a hallucination? That's not entirely out of the question. Uh, that's a real popular dance move, the elongating of the torso. Oh, but the... Shrink oh, that little baby hippo is not happy. The shrinking of the torso, though. That was a new one. And the third time Oswald's been <laughs> smashed in that skull. What an evil thing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't... I... <laughs> That was still fun. <laughs> a little worried about Oswald and that demonic baby hippo, but all in all, <laughs> it was still a very enjoyable short. Hey, LeoLegacy.com, folks. Come on over to LeoLegacy.com and scope out all the killer content we got for you, including our Skeleton Crew store. Skeleton Crew is our lifestyle brand for freaks, geeks, and monsters streetwear, apparel, merchandise, accessories, all featuring graphics digitally crafted by me. Also by me, my podcast, Leo Legacy's Radnor Rock. The podcast so rad, it's going to rock your world. Wreck your world? I don't know. That was like a tagline I was trying for a while, but it's really me just super deep diving into just random things that I find to be rad. So there you have it. Check that out, but if you want something with more direction, Nerd Cult Underground, my comedy comrade Field Mouse and I are starting a new religion called the Nerd Cult Underground. Join us and get acquainted and join the ranks of the Nerd Cult Underground across all your favorite podcast platforms. Thanks for liking, commenting, subscribing, hitting that ding-dong notification bell, and you can find Leal Legacy across all your favorite podcasts social media platforms at Leal Legacy. And as always, be a friend, tell a friend. Thanks.